Hello everyone, Turtleman124342 one here, and before we start the video, I just wanted to give a quick shout out to Venomous Gaming's channel. I they added me on Steam and we had a nice chat and I just wanted to give them a shout out because yeah, they are just really nice to me. So please check out their channel. They have some nice Minecraft texture pack videos. I might actually download the texture packs because of them. Well anyway, let's get to the upgrade. Alright, so if you want to upgrade the Photon, you have to answer yourself some questions. First, what do I want to be doing with this computer? Two, and how long do you want the upgrade to last? Of course, okay, there's only two questions, but whatever. So, if you want to be gaming on this computer, and your game is mostly graphics bound, then I would recommend getting a stronger graphics card, of course. But then... If you want to get one of the higher-end graphics cards, you're going to have to get a better power supply also. The Photon comes packed with a 430-watt power supply, and majority of the better graphics cards require about 500 watt. So if you want to get a better graphics card, you're going to have to go out and buy another, a bigger, better power supply. But this graphics card can already handle most of the modern games at maximum settings. Here, right here, I'm playing Battlefield 4. So if you don't, you don't have to spend the money right away. But if you just want that peak performance, then I recommend just sticking with this for at least a couple years. Because, I mean, this computer is, it, it'll run fine. Now, if you want to be photo editing and all that stuff, you're going to need more RAM and a better CPU. And if you want to upgrade to the high-end AMD cards, like the AMD FX series, then you're gonna need a better motherboard because this motherboard, I don't, do not believe it supports the AMD FX series of uh, CPUs. So you're gonna have to go out and buy another motherboard, unfortunately. And you know what you can always do? Here's one thing I'm planning on doing. Once I upgrade pretty much my entire computer, I use all the old parts, slap it in another case, and you got another computer. And then just in a couple years, just give it just you have a second computer right there. But Yes, if you want to be gaming, you're going to need a better graphics card and power supply. If you want to be photo editing, more RAM and a better CPU. Just ask me in the comments what you guys are considering of upgrading. I mean, like, I just wanted to make this quick video just in case you're thinking, like, what I want to do with this computer in the future and what can I do. So you can maybe get, like, a GTX 980 in the future when the price comes down and all that stuff. But, yeah, let me know in the comments. I'll try to respond with whatever I can give to help you guys out. Well, anyway, enjoy the video. Turtle Man out. Real quick, you guys, I just want to let you know that if you want to upgrade this computer to do Photoshop and After Effects, do not get DDR4 memory yet. Get motherboards that are compatible with DDR4 because that will be necessary in the future, but DDR3 is good for now. You can stick with DDR3. Turtle Man out.